Always alerting. Always tracking. This is Next Weather. Ooh, Casey, I almost sneezed on air there. <laughs> um, it's a gorgeous day. We've said it over and over. I mean, it's just beautiful out. You can't ask for nicer weather in South Florida right yeah, now. Yeah, I mean, yesterday, man, we had that bright blue sky. Didn't have much cloud cover. We had high pressure right overhead. Sinking motion of air leads to those clear conditions. Today, we've got a little bit more of an easterly breeze that'll be back with us by this afternoon, pulling in a few more clouds, but should still be a really nice Sunday. Here we are taking a look out across downtown. Temperatures currently at 70 degrees, Miami. 70 up through Fort Lauderdale. You're in the upper 60s right now in Key West. Winds currently out of the north, but again, those will start to shift around a little bit by this afternoon. Still, though, if you're heading out to Tortuga Music Festival, this is today's forecast. Couple clouds for today. Uh, should be really nice there. Fort Lauderdale Beach, if you're maybe heading out there to listen to some country music, temperatures will be pretty comfortable in the upper 70s and lower 80s. Currently, we still have some 60s on the map. Pembroke Pines, Opelika, and Kendall still sitting in the 60s as we're starting to gradually warm things up today, featuring another dry day, and we're expecting a nice dry weather, a uh, uh, dry radar rather, at least in through about Wednesday. It's by about Thursday, Friday that we'll be tracking our next system approaching and that will be bringing us a chance for a few showers. High pressure to the north of us keeps us in this dry stretch of weather, though. Through Wednesday, notice by Thursday, we see that tick up a little bit, and Friday's the day we'll be looking at our highest chance to rain here, at least out of the next six, seven days, but even that chance not looking overly impressive. It's all going to be thanks to a cold front that will be moving through Thursday night to Friday. And much like the last front, bring us a quick moving line of some showers, and then it's in and out of here just in time for next weekend. As for today, couple clouds, partly sunny skies, what we'll call it for today. We keep it dry. Nice breeze coming in off the ocean. We'll uptake that humidity just ever so slightly, but still should still uh, should still be very comfortable for today. 82 for a high temperature. That's right about where we were yesterday. Tomorrow, similar upper 70s, lower 80s for that solar eclipse. If you're going to be and about viewing that at three o'clock the afternoon. It's when we see our max solar eclipse 301 should be comfortable. Upper 70s, lower 80s with just a few clouds, but we should not have any rain for tomorrow either. Out on the beach, rip current risk will be moderate today. UV index extreme. Make sure to use the sunscreen. Boating forecast, no alerts for Atlantic waters today. Those winds a little bit calmer out of the east northeast at about 10 to 15 knots. Seas at two to three feet. Moderate chop across our bays and no alerts down to the keys either. 84 tomorrow, 80 on Tuesday, Wednesday, 83 degrees. We are going to be looking at some warmer temperatures by Thursday. That's out ahead of that front with the high of 87 degrees. Front moves through with a few showers, and then we start to cool things down a little bit more as we head into next weekend. All right. Thank you so much, Casey. It's looking great out there.